Good morning, YouTube family. It is um, September 11th, 2018. Um, 17 years ago today, the towers fell. You know, our country was attacked, and, um, you know, it kind of, anybody and everyone, I think, who was alive and can remember it happening, old enough to remember it happening, and where they were at and everything that day, today will always hold kind of like a... gloom and doom over you, you know, um, where was I? I was 20 years old and that summer I had worked at a golf course here close to home and, um, was the beer cart girl, my favorite job of all time. And, um, but anyway, I was the beer cart girl and it was actually my very last day of work, August 13th, I think it was. Anyhow, I had um, wrecked the golf cart and broke my leg. So I had to sit out that semester from college. So on September 11th, I was still in bed when the first tower was struck. And, you know, and then we used to have these machines that recorded your messages. <laughs> Can answer machines for any of you young people out there might be watching this that don't know what an answer machine is. Um, we had a landline and the answering machine in our house was upstairs in this middle room in the middle room upstairs If you guys have seen it, I call the playroom a lot that doesn't actually have toys in it, it just has junk in it But back then it had the answer machine in it And my dad was at work And I heard my dad come on over in the answer machine saying squirt Get out of bed Go downstairs Turn TV on there's history happening. So I got out of bed. I wobbled down the stairs with my broken leg on my crutches. And got downstairs just in time as I turned the TV on to see the second tire struck. I remember thinking that day that I wished I could go up and help. I was, you know, I was just getting ready to start my nursing class. I was just getting ready to start them. And I wanted so bad to go help, you know, and do what I could. But what could I have done at that point with a broken leg? So I prayed. Um, but, you know, to this day, it's just horrific to think that our country was um, attacked like that. And that could happen again. It's probably going to happen again. You know, the scary thing is, is it's probably going to happen again in my lifetime. It's going to happen in my kid's lifetime. Something like that. Our world right now is a scary place. Um, and I think today's 9-11 really hits home even a little bit more with me because my brother's overseas. I mean, he's been in the National Guard, um, Air National Guard for years now I mean he's probably been in there 15 years now I'd say and um he's on his first deployment right now and he I don't know it's a hitting a little bit closer to home today it's bothering me a little bit more closer to home because you know my brother's overseas and he's not actively fighting for us but he's protecting us so I just want everybody to take a moment and just um, you know, pray and thank God for keeping the you know ones of us safe that day. That it could that it wasn't worse than what it could have been. You know, and that our country stood tall and showed the rest of the world how strong we actually are. So I'm gonna um, take a moment of silence here, and I just want everybody to do the same, please. Starting now.
God bless America.